Hello everybody, this is Dr. Kevin Novak again. And I'm going to give you an update of the Biosynosis Clarification Basket I added to my SCA Aquarium Sump. Now the opening in the sump is 4 by 6 or 7 high by 16 long. And as you remember my last video, I just bought a little crate or a box there. And uh, this was 3 by 11 by 6 high. And this is the screening that I used inside and on the top of it to keep the kitty litter and laterite in place. But when I was at my local nursery, I found these baskets, 4x4x4. Four by four by four. They're made in Holland, and they were only 2 bucks a piece. This is what I wanted. These baskets here fit the SCA Aquarium Sump absolutely perfect. So if you have a 50-gallon uh, SCA Aquarium like I do, and the 16 gallon sump these baskets will fit in the center perfect and I was able to add three of these so I increased my uh, noxic filter by 50 percent by using these baskets you just cut the mesh screen so it's about an inch bigger in the basket because this is what's going to go on top you fill the basket halfway full once again the same way as my last video you fill it halfway full with kitty litter and the next thing you're going to do is add your laterite or some kind of iron additive you have to add to this basket. The iron is important for the factory data bacteria to, to grow. And therefore, it's uh, going to take a little bit of time. My, my old basket was set up for 45 days. And, of course, this is the new one. You mix the kitty litter and laterite. You wet it down real good. Clean it off. As you see, it just looks like any kind of substrate. looks like gravel because uh, this is baked clay. This isn't the kind that dissolves, so this will last forever. And because these baskets have a little slit, you have to cut it and slide it into the slit, and it'll hold the cover in place. And there's two. there's four slits on all sides and that holds the top on and of course you just cut the top to suit the basket and this fits right into the sump you're able to add three of these baskets into the sump so water can go around the basket and uh, I'm very happy I found these because this is exactly what I wanted for the sump but anyway I decided to uh, test out the old basket that I had in there and reuse what I had and already factutated bacteria was growing. Oxygen levels were in between, between two, three parts per million. Uh, here's the three baskets sitting in the SCA sump. They sit perfect. They have a space in between them. Water can go flow around them. And this is what you're going to be doing for your denitrification. And this works out better than a... Pl uh, um, uh, refrugum filter. Uh, you can add plants to this, but there's no reason to add plants to this. Uh, you can just put the baskets just like you see here. It's that simple. This will do your denitrification. Uh, the tank's been running with the old basket in it. Two of these baskets have the old material. One basket has brand new material. And uh, as you can see, the baskets fit perfectly into the sump. So if you buy one of these aquariums and have one of these sumps, it's going to be perfect. But if you can, these baskets uh, I consider to be the best to use for the biosynosis clarification baskets. And of course, now this becomes an anoxic filter. So I have a 50% increase in my anoxic filter. And the water is absolutely crystal clear and the good thing of it is it's already in 45 days uh, factutated bacteria was already growing just like it was supposed to. The old basket, the kitty litter and laterite were sweet and perfect, nothing wrong, no anaerobic bacteria, nothing. So let's do a test on my tank right now. Brand new test strip. Let's test it out, see what the nitrates were with the old basket 
I just put these baskets in today, so but let's see what the nitrates are. And let's see. Okay, it's not even showing up. So the basket did its job. It took what little nitrates I did have and brought them right down to zero. As you can see, it's not even showing up. There's no nitrites. And as you can see, I do have hard water. And, uh, but I think that's pretty good for the basket being in there for only about 45 days. That's, I'm not going to complain about that. That's nitrates right down to zero. Brand new test. Now I can do that all day. Anyhow, just want to make a short video, let you know how everything was going. I increased my anoxy filter by 50%. Uh, I hope uh, you enjoyed the video. Until next time, goodbye.